Hey, we have here another integral from MIT 2013. Problem 17, we have the integral of 2 ln x plus ln x all squared dx. Okay, it's odd that we're actually adding two things because that means I can break this into two integrals and I think I'll just do that. So we'll write this as integral of 2 ln x dx plus integral of ln x squared dx. And my first thought when we're integrating ln x is to use integration by power. So I'm gonna do I think what I'm going to do is put this one aside for now. We know that this, this is a very common integral. This is actually going to be x ln x minus x. But I'm not going to worry about that because we're going to focus on this one. And what I'm going to do, because we have the ln x, I'm going to use integration by parts. And we'll use the di method, tabular integration, to set this up. I want to differentiate. We can choose what to differentiate or integrate. We don't, know how to, we don't really know how to integrate this. So what I can do is I'm going to create a 1 in front, we'll integrate the 1, and then I'm going to differentiate ln x all squared. Notice the parentheses are really important here. If the square was on the x, then we could pull it out front and it would be exactly the same as this, but the parentheses means we're squaring the whole thing. Okay, then taking the derivative over here, we're going to have 2 ln x, and then chain rule, the derivative of ln x is 1 over x. Integrating this, we're just going to have x. So then we have part of the answer here, and then we need to integrate this. Well, what's going to happen here is this x and this x is going to cancel. So just summarizing everything we have, we have this integral to ln x. Then we have this diagonal term. We have x ln x squared. And then we have minus. Well, this is going to cancel with this, and we're going to have 2 ln x. Don't really need the parentheses there, but I put it in there. And then the thing to notice is this integral and this integral are exactly the same, so those cancel to zero. And then we're left with just our final answer, which is gonna be x ln x all squared plus c. So that's it, the cancellation makes it pretty easy. So we'll stop it there. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a great day.